Aries, this is just with your September 2021 general read. I hope you guys are having an enjoyable day so far. So Aries, uh, having to make a decision between two for some of you. Uh, we'll get into this third party energy in a minute. For those of you uh, who's employed, it looks like you're going to be embarking on some new things in the workplace. I see new opportunities, new accounts, new work ventures that are coming your way. You will find yourself pretty busy in September. It probably will go all the way through uh, Libra season, which is, um, I, I believe it's in some time in October. So that definitely will mark a new beginning for you when it comes to work and career. I see money increasing for you guys. That looks really good. And where you seem to have been stressed out, overworked, worried about a situation. I do see that some of you are starting to come out of that place of worry. Just make sure that you're not overindulging in place of trying to numb yourself from some pain, aggravation, or frustration. I see work being done on the home, whether it be you doing the work or work being done on your home and others of you making decisions of what you're going to do moving forward regarding home life. Some of you are going to be moving, buying property, um, selling property. So I do see works in that area of home if you are looking for work congratulations i see a job coming your way uh, now this is karmic so that means for some of you it may not last very long um it is an e um, a means to an end so you need money okay it's coming in for you you may have this for the next eight months or so others of you this is an opportunity to align yourself with a company or business that feels like home some of you may be working with family members closer to home but you will feel like this new beginning is just what you need and it's a kind of a fresh start in the right direction so congratulations for those of you aries out there who are newly employed or soon will be hired and this is very soon like happening now this month you will be getting hired if you're looking for work get out there and put your resumes out because you will find work almost immediately there's a lot of work to, out there and it looks like you're going to be very busy with this work now it's it's kind of like a mundane type of a job uh, but this is something again that will last for a little bit or it could be something that will be long lasting but it is something that you feel like this is the right fit for you finally right uh those of you who are self-employed i see money coming in loans um grants anything that you've applied for i get that there's good news coming there i also see an uptick in your finances so money looks good overall for you aries out there who are focusing on that do be careful with people around you though because you have some people yes are stressed out have you stressed anyone out, Aries? You have people who are more stressed than you know, more worried than you know. I don't think you guys really understand how much stress, anxiety, hurt, and pain someone is going through around you. And check up on the people that you don't talk to quite often because they're heading toward um, some type of stress and some type of mental anxiety and worry. So do check up on people, especially if you Aries are in a good place and you're feeling pretty good, check up a, a, about the people around you. Um, and, and also be careful of energy vampires, people who, um, because they're miserable and life isn't going so well for them, they kind of trying to spill that over on you. But this looks more to me to be people who are depressed, who really don't even understand just how much they are suffering. Um, and But they're suffering in silence. There's someone in your life that is suffering in silence and you probably don't know. You may know somewhat, but you don't know to the full extent or you don't even know at all that this person is having a bit of an issue. Now, I do see some issues here with not letting go of the past and still holding on to the past and having a hard time uh, moving past that and getting to a place of peace. For some of you, it has to do with a family dynamic where you and your family, it's almost like no going back to this family situation. And it hurts you. It haunts you. And I do feel like the other people or person involved, they're not in a good place either. But some of you kind of have to let go of a family dynamic. And it's not easy. Again, be careful with over drinking, indulging, that sort of thing, um, just to numb the pain. And if you need help, definitely reach out to other people. I feel like this could have started, um, this could have became a problem since May of this year. And I do feel like you Aries are trying to move forward with your life in spite of everything else. Um, 
you're trying to tuck any issues that you have away and move forward in your life, you will be uh, the source of help and healing to others around you. And people do need honesty. Just be a little bit tactful with the way that you um, share your thoughts with people. Because I do feel like there's a lot of sensitive souls around you. Now, let's look at love. Uh, single Aries ladies, what's coming up for you? Well, see, you've been taking a break from love, focusing more on your money. Your money has increased. Secretly, you're building a little bit of an empire. Secretly, people really don't even understand just how financially stable you are becoming or you will be. And I do feel like you're kind of ready to get yourself back out there and give love a chance again. You have a decision to make. Do you want old? Do you want new? And you too are stressing a lot of worry and stress over where you're going from here, what your next steps are going to be. For some reason, I'm picking up on a lonely road ahead. Some of you ladies may feel like you've had to tackle life all on your own, and it has been quite the daunting task, okay? Um, some of you may dream of a perfect life with someone you may dream of a past person that you've had a significant relationship with and in those dreams you get a lot of clarity sorry guys um so but when you have these dreams it's giving you clarity um, a lot of insight as well i do feel like there's a lot of downloads coming to you ladies now so do take your dreams into account and if you can remember them write them down and look back on them later you have a lot of money coming in ladies a lot of money coming in oh and i do see new love coming your way as well now this could be a water sign this could be someone from your past or new but this kind of feels more new to me and this person is coming in guns blazing this is someone who's going to be very open to you and tell you exactly how they feel uh, the problem might be that you're not so ready, especially if you know this person. You're definitely not going to be open to it. But a new person, you may not be 100% ready to open your heart just yet because you're still kind of attached to, I get a fire sign energy male here. Uh, so when this water sign man come in, somebody who's a little bit more caring, more sensitive, more open, more vulnerable, more engaging with you, you're still connected to this old person. You have a lot of people wanting you if you put yourself out there. But again, love is very strong on you when it comes to a specific man. I get an earth sign. could be another fire sign like you. But you may have an option of a couple of people if you put yourself out there and give someone a chance. Love could definitely be knocking on your door if you let it in. But there's a part of you that's still heavily attached to another person. Now let's look at you single Aries men. Everyone's taking a break. Some of you may be going on vacation. I do see some of you men who have been healing. You want to reconcile with someone here. Sagittarius looks very strong to me. Um, and wanting someone from your past, working really hard, stressing about love to an extent, but keeping that stress quietly to yourself. You want this woman you've been thinking about her heavily, but you're taking a break. And again, it's coming out really strong as a fire sign woman. So Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, but she doesn't have to be that sign. She's coming up as fire. Uh, some of you may have two women on your mind. Oh, excuse me, three women on your mind. Some of you men are getting to know one woman and you may feel like things are growing with her, but you still have this burning desire for another person. You have baggage that you're carrying. I feel the people that you're getting to know or this person in particular, Particular, you're not really letting her know fully just how connected you are to your past. I do feel like you dream about people as well. You go back to the days that you've had those special moments with someone. But overall, it looks like you Aries men want new love. You want new relationship and you know it's going to take some time because you're in the process of moving. This may be a literal move. This can just be moving for work. This may be that you put work before love and that is your more practical side of life and some of you it's like i have to focus on this this is my priority right now and once these things are taken care of i can give love more of a focus you're still holding on man you're still holding on you know you you are moving forward 
you're moving ahead, but you're definitely still holding on to someone from the past, okay? Um, and I feel like you may feel more able to finally put it behind you when we get into Scorpio season, which is in November, okay? So it's coming closer. But if you saw the yearly, the Aries yearly reading, then you would know exactly where you're at in this love aspect in your life and where you're headed. So I definitely see um, putting the past behind you, although it is a daunting task, you will be able to do that as time goes on. Now let's look at you couples, okay? Not able, you know, this relationship was an issue with not being able to leave the past in the past. Whatever the dramas, whatever the problems are, you were unable to leave things in the past. It could be a lot of conflict and friction over children, um, over, again, past issues. You're seeing the future with your person, though, but there are some things that either you feel they keep hidden or you do. Uh, some of you, you may you may have some competition on the side for some of you Aries or your person may have competition secretly is what it looks like to me. Some of you, again, going back to the beginning of this reading, there may be another person that someone is seeing on the side. And this relationship, the biggest issue with this relationship for those of you that aren't um, seeing someone else and there is no third party is money. And that's what I constantly see in relationships. The problem here is money. Somebody is pulling all the weight or someone is really irresponsible when it comes to money. So as soon as it comes in, it's out the door. And not only is it out the door, but now someone is in the deficit and owing money as well. So if it's not you, Aries, definitely be careful about entering into a very committed relationship with another person. Um, and check your bank accounts, check your credit cards, make sure that you triple and double check and make sure that you are looking at your money, especially if you're the one being responsible financially, because you may um, come up to a problem with your finances up ahead. I feel like some of you are very patient with your partner. You're very loving. You try to do the best that you can, but they may have vices that are problematic to this relationship. Your person, uh, yeah, I see it now. Your person definitely have some vices here when it comes to money, when it comes to control issues here. Uh, also, there could be some um, sex addictions is what it looks like to me. Your person could be someone that is very confusing to you. They're very secretive, whether it's by choice or by force. There's something about them that you may feel like they are always a mystery. You really can't figure out where they are in life, how they feel about you, where they stand. You may not really know exactly what they do for a living, um, where money comes from with them, where they are in life. There's an aspect of their life or something about them that's very mysterious and you still aren't able to get a full understanding of who they are, what's really going on with them. They may give you like breadcrumb. You give you a little bit of information and then hold a lot back. But you're wise enough and you're smart and keen enough to pay attention to all the little nuances with your person to try to get things uh, together. Now, I do see that for some of you, your person has money issues, money woes, um, or it's hard for them to fully focus on this relationship and give you all of them, perhaps because there's still a part of them that is attached to a past person. And I do feel for some of you, this person is talking to that person on the side lines, okay? They've been in communication for some time now, um, and that may have stirred back up some feelings. This may be all because of quote unquote, the children, that sort of thing. So I do see some issues with that. Others of you be very careful with your mate because I see some issues when it comes to your finances, their finances, um, and some things that they're hiding when it comes to their finances or things that they're hiding when it comes to a past person, especially if this person has something to do with children or if they still have some type of residual energy that still binds and connects them together. Okay, I do see that as being a bit of an issue here. 
So that's what I have for you guys. If you're interested in looking deeper into this relationship aspect for you couples, you can always check out the extended down below. Otherwise, um, you can also find the Aries 2021 yearly and the link to my website. If you are new to this channel, welcome and subscribe because I will be back very soon with another one. Take care, Aries.